Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to London for Global Champions League. It is the 12th stage of the season. A season with only 15 stages, so only three left after our visit to the Royal Hospital Chelsea here in the heart of London, right by the River Thames. The question of the afternoon. Is Can Stars, powered by Iron Dames, the championship leaders, going to be the first team ever in GCL history to win three consecutive stages? This is what the ranking looks like. 26 points of difference between Can Stars and Stockholm Hearts. Then, small gap, only seven from the Hearts to the Doha Falcons and to Riesenbeck International. Between Riesenbeck and Prague, the battle for top four, only 10 points separating them. And it is Valkeswad two points behind Prague Lions. At the bottom, New York Empire and Scandinavian Vikings in last place on the same points tally. This is what the course looks like, built by Uyano Fezzani. It's empty of options, it's not overly big, not overly tall, but plenty of uh, possibilities. And there comes the first man, it's Andreas Kau for the Istanbul Warriors, powered by Carpe Diem. Extra stride again, he's got 15 seconds to get home, final line is coming up, time will be good for Skau. And added six into the double of uprights and just inside the time, but clear. And that is the first clear for Skau in three stages. Unsuccessful in Monaco and in Riesenbeck. Now connects with clears again. Andreas Skau on Billy Matador. Here is the young Danish, Zasha Nugard Lil. Does wait here and then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eighth stride into the combination. Did not risk the seven to get to that last part and jumps it clear on the debut. Zasha Nugart and Stanley. It's clear for them, it's clear for Skau, it's clear for Istanbul Warriors powered by Carpe Diem. Stockholm Hearts powered by H&M Wheel of Horses are the first team to come in in the whole championship discussion you could look at uh, the championship race the battle with Kent Stars or are they actually looking down looking at Doha Falcons and Riesenbeck International Stockholm are 26 points behind the leaders and only seven in front of both Doha and Riesenbeck International just aiming for a clear comes on the inside line for seven here so the five get nice and supports Moya and jumps it clear that's all he wanted and that's exactly what he needed it's a clear for Stockholm Hearts powered by H&M Philippe Hearts now to secure a double clear to get level with Istanbul Warriors also on the safe route and he has it down Philip Arts has got the vertical down that he wanted to protect so much, the Oxa rather, that he wanted to protect so much. On five in, support him and jumps it and leaves it on just four penalties. The first team on four penalties as a matter of fact is Stockholm Hearts powered by H&M We Love Horses. A rail of the lead come in second place. Over to Valka Swart United. Air of the 12 penalties of Madrid Emotion and the 8 of Rome Gladiators have taken them out of the race for the top four. Oh, goes for eight and deep, and then it's a lot of effort from Luna. There is an option for seven. He held for eight. Looks that she gets a touch strong now, which will help them to close the five strides in that final line. There you have it, clear, clear, Gilles Thomas and Luna van der Denhoff jump clear in the first round of Global Champions League here in London. Equanimerka, unique de Franport with John. It's going well, no issues with the time allowed, most pairs finish around 66, 68 seconds, time allowed is 75, so not a problem for Whitaker. 
going for double clear quite fast into the double and double clear it is and it could even be the lead it is by more than three seconds Volker Swart take the lead and are swinging and fighting for their spot in the top four Volker Swart have now put pressure on those still to come thinking of Prague Lions Rizabek and Doha of course even if they come last after the second round they cannot lose their lead so it's a fairly comfortable stage for can stars on one side on the other side this is a moment where they can write history no team in the history of the league before has ever won three consecutive stages and the can stars won in monte carlo in the small ring of paul de Hercule. they've won on the big grass ring of Utgerbeerbaum in riesenbeck and now they're here across the channel in uh, the Royal Hospital Chelsea here in London. Oh, my goodness. Well, that was a miss, if you ask me, but still unclear. Natalie Dean is still clear after a scary and hairy moment. Oh, whoa, whoa. Clear around Natalie Dean and Akota. Not quite how that was expected, but the zero stands for Natalie Dean. It's actually her first clear for the team this season Janne Federike Maier Zimmerman with a high level high level now a touch strong Zimmerman puts her back on the high leg reactive jumping putting in efforts there high level at the age of nine not that experienced not like Messi or others Oaks are out of the way oh and double clear can stars go double clear and time wise they are behind Valkus Swart and behind Istanbul but they have jumped double clear again those are now 10 consecutive clears from uh, the can stars the Prague Lions are next powered by Czech equestrian team they are 10 points behind on Riesenbeck International Prague Lions sit in fifth place uh, this is Angelica Augustson Zanotelli. The most difficult part out of the way. Augustson Zanotelli. For her, oh no, I was going to say for her first clear this season. No! The first one to be faulted in that double combination. Oh! That one stings. 68 20 on the five strides into the combination. De Vos next with Toupie de la Roque. Oh, and Toupie rolls that second fence at Lugano Diamonds. This seems to be a major blow for the Prague Lions. Reason back international powered by Kingsland. Still looking for their first win this season. On the other hand, this season already good for five podium finishes Harry Allen alongside Christian Kukuk Harry Allen on Lukaku well controlled slightly fussy with his head and there as he comes out of the turn you could see him play with his head Kukuk last year he jumped 15 clears out of 23 rounds oh no clear for Kukuk. Indeed, this is Valkerswart's round because Kukuk's rail, in fact, keeps Prague Lions alive. And home with eight penalties the total. Four for Harry Allen and four for Christian Kukuk. New York Empire, third last to go powered by Lugano Diamonds and Bresch still clear main man of the team so far with four out of six clears uh, that is about to become five out of seven clear round for Scott Bresch and for Chadora Lady with the Scandinavian Vikings currently in 12th and last place on 12 penalties now to Richard Vogel with Churchill also a horse with no outings in global Champions League classes 
Stead into the table and that's gone. Yeah, so New York Empire on four penalties. And a fast run in 62.15, but four penalties for Richard Vogel. And so also for New York Empire, powered by Lugano Diamonds. Where do they go? They are faster, obviously, than uh, Stockholm Hearts. So they are fourth at the moment, just a rail off the lead. And here are the standings. Volker Swart, Istanbul and Cannes on clears, double clears. Then fours for New York and Stockholm. And then eights for Shanghai, for Rome, for Prague, for Mexico, for Riesenbeck. And twelves for Madrid, Doha, Scandinavian Vikings. And unfortunately, Monaco Aces, they were eliminated. Top four is something that is very much on the, the agenda at the moment. And the other teams seem to have opened it up for you. Going into round two, how hungry are you to fight for it? Yeah, indeed, top four is still possible. Uh, and also especially riding together with John here, uh, it's his biggest home show, so I'm uh, extra motivated. Gilles Thomas and John Whitaker lead with Valkyrie Swart United after round one here in uh, London as the pensioners are enjoying some uh, time off in hospitality and we get ready for the second round of Global Champions League. Arkan Stars going to make it three out of three and three consecutive wins, the first team ever. Or are Valkyrie Swart United going to score their first win this uh, season? Be back on time for the second round live here from uh, London at Royal Hospital Chelsea. Bye-bye.